हेलो वन वेलकम टू बायोलॉजिकल आई होप यू ऑल आर डूइंग वेल एंड गुड आई एम अर्पित चतुर्वेदी एंड हेयर आई एम जस्ट वॉन्ट टू शेयर सम ऑफ माई इंटरव्यू एक्सपीरियंस डेट आई हैड फेस्ड लास्ट ईयर ऑन द बार्क ओ सी एस एग्जामिनेशन आफ्टर द बार्क ओ सी एस एग्जामिनेशन सो देर आर फ्यू थिंग्स डेट आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर लाइक यू गाइज आर गेटिंग नर्वस लाइक ये स्टडे बार्क ओ सी एस या बार्क एस रिलीज इज रिजल्ट फॉर द ओ सी एस एग्जामिनेशन एंड वेरी फ्यू स्टूडेंट्स गॉट सेलेक्टेड फॉर द इंटरव्यू या गॉट शॉर्ट रिसर्स फॉर द इंटरव्यू लाइक ओनली थर्टी सिक्स स्टूडेंट्स आर देयर इन दी लिस्ट ओके एंड दिस हैपन्स दिस हैपन्स दिस इज रियल दिस दिस काइंड ऑफ थिंग हैपन्स ओके इन बार्क स्पेशली एंड very few students will get selected after the uh, selection interviews so just don't take it on your heart don't get disheartened just uh, if you have this opportunity then just go and enjoy it uh, there is nothing to do like anything else than that just enjoy just give your best and uh, they will ask everything like you have studied till now in your life if you ask me that what are the questions you what kind of question they had asked me when i uh, faced the interview okay so i already told about the uh, the criteria or the environment of the interview or the interview room like once you enter the interview room uh, you have to just uh, go and wish them like uh, good morning or good evening anything like that and you will get to sit in front of them okay they could be like 4 uh, 5 6 or 8 depending on uh, like what time it is and uh, how they are interested okay how much they are interested okay so what uh, just happened was like uh, i went inside i wished them and i sat down and they start asking me okay so you are arpit chaturvedi okay you have done msc in biochemistry so i said yes then they started like uh, the very very important thing that i didn't knew uh, like i didn't know uh, but it's uh, your uh, like you are lucky if you are getting this uh, to know like uh, they ask so many things or uh, they ask uh, just by focusing on the things that are there or the papers that are there in your mark sheets okay like what are the papers that you have dealt in your uh, post graduation because they have all your mark sheets all all the semester mark sheet uh, in front of them okay so they will just ask accordingly it's a myth or i can say like uh, they didn't ask me my favorite five topics okay they did ask like one Uh, you, you can say about uh, one or two topic that you like the most okay i said immunology but the thing is you will uh, you will just get asked the questions from your the previous examination the papers that you have taken during your post grad okay so it's just a beginning i just want to sh- uh, share some of the questions that were asked uh by uh, as to me during the interview session so very first question when i just uh, reach the green board they ask they ask like uh, arpit do you know how to purify a protein and i said uh, yes and uh, then he asked like uh, okay you have to purify two proteins one is in the cytosol and one is in the plasma membrane how will you do it is the very first question then after that the second professor or the second scientist asked like uh, have you heard about enzymes i said yes then what is enzymes okay then uh, like uh, what are the different properties of enzymes they did focus on, on enzyme too much okay then suppose you have two enzymes and you have to uh, just like Uh, compare them that which enzyme is best the what are the different properties that you will be focusing on your experiment or in your experiment so i said kmv max and catalytic efficiency 
then they ask me the formulas for each and every uh, component each and everything and also the definition of each and everything then the next scientist asked me to draw the krebs cycle okay then i uh, did the same then she asked like uh, what are the connecting reactions that are there in the krebs cycle like the anaplerotic reactions okay so different anaplerotic reactions were there i drew this uh, drew them okay then the next scientist started asking about plant physiology like uh, uh, do you know about minerals like minerals are important to plants uh, then what what do you think what are macronutrients and what are uh, micronutrients how much amount is required in both of them okay, yeah for both of them and uh, what is the role of potassium what is the role of magnesium uh, like manganese these kind of minerals they ask then it gets switched to immunology okay like what do you love about yeah what do you like about immunology then after that they ask me like there is one dendritic cell there is one dendritic cell here in the secondary lymphoid organ or we can say like uh, this roaming around in the blood and the uh, the dendritic cells just get met with the antigen then it move to the secondary lymphoid organ to activate the t cell then what are the different cytokines what of what are the different proteins chemicals that will uh, just take part in the inducing yeah, in the induction of the t cell like the activation of the t cell okay like the t cell and b cell maturation pathway t cell and b cell activation pathway these things were asked like uh, then the question was raised about the graft rejection then they are most important they are most uh, like pasand uh, the topic unka okay uh, they are most favorite like dna repair and uh, dna repair mechanism so they ask like uh, what are the kind of mutation that uh, happens in the dna uh, like uh, what are dna repair mechanism can you tell me the types of dna repair mechanism okay so there are different type of dna repair mechanism you all have must heard about okay do read them all don't go without reading yeah without preparing dna repair mechanism okay in your interview okay then there are some other fellows that uh, faced the interview on the same day i did so i asked them like uh, what are the what are the kind of question they are asking so one of the fellow was a, uh, from msc zoology background okay so he told me that they were asking him about the bones of the body the what are the different kinds of bones like uh, are the bones similar in us and other animals what are their difference okay homologous analogous organs like chromosomal aberrations these are some things but i insist or i uh, just force you to study those things that are there in your msc uh, papers okay those things that are there in your msc papers like uh, what are the papers like i i in during my post graduation i uh, the papers were there like ipr immunology plant biochemistry enzymology that's why they ask me the questions relating uh, relating to this but if you have in your examination like in your papers during your msc uh, something like uh, the animal behavior or like this then they will ask a question accordingly okay don't just get too nervous otherwise it will be too difficult for you to face the interview and and i already made a video on uh, how to yeah what to wear how to go what you have to do what you don't have to do then uh, do watch it i will share the link of the video and if you need any kind of personal like support and anything you can really contact me i'll give my contact detail okay so do contact me and i will try my best to support you as much as possible okay so thank you so much and all the very best for your upcoming interview bye bye